My name is uh, Mark Verhasselt. I farm with my brother Dale and our wives Sandy and Alyssa. We have a 600 cow dairy farm with a double 11 herringbone Germania parlor. We just live south of Green Bay. We put the smart lights in middle of October. Uh, we chose the smart lights uh, last two years at the farm show. We've been looking at them and looking at different dealers and we like the simple cleanness and the technology it gave us to adapt to the times. Uh, LDS was a very good dealer uh, working with and they gave us confidence when we talked to them about the smart light. We knew they knew what they were talking about and it gave us confidence to go with them. And the parlor, it needed new guts being 28 years old and with our Germania Parlor air, air system, the Bomatic Smart Light fit very well into what we had with minimal changes. And installing was, you know, minimal because four units right in the middle of the box makes it easy if we do ever have to change anything and it keeps all the other ones going. They integrated very nice, uh, the installation, the dealer was very you know, he could work on the top while we milked and you couldn't tell that it wasn't made for the system when it was done. We had to drill no extra holes in the pans or nothing. Uh, it was it was nice. Uh, the smart lights were very accurate. Our other system getting old, we had a lot of milkers on manual and the first milking that night, the guy told me to tell the workers not to get manual happy and and just see how they do and talking to the workers the next day they talked about how they milked out so nice without using manual at all the touch buttons the workers really uh, adapted nice to them the single button has been really easy to use for the workers uh, the gloves on it doesn't make a difference to the workers yeah the leds are very nice uh, to them with the different colors we got the green when they're milking, the red when they're done, flashing red, if it would come off early, kicked off or whatever, and purple for manual, which with these we haven't really had to use, which is why we switched our detachers. Uh, the history reports are nice just to see the milking flow between the different shifts of workers and how they keep it moving, why if some group is taking long, what is the issue? It's just nice if, if we ever have a milker that is not working right, we would know. We could look in the reports to see if, if it was doing it, you know, every time. On the real time, it was nice because I you can't be by the workers all the time. When you're there, everybody does good, but they know that it's there and they're held a little more accountable. And it's not like having a camera on them, but you can see the actual job they are doing. I'm really satisfied with the smart lights. Uh, the milking, the tea dens has always been the biggest problem, you know, and the detacher is such an important part of the timeliness of milkers coming off. And I can't believe how how nice they, they work.